Hey guys, in this tutorial we're going to be learning about how to access different functions from separate scripts. So it's kind of like how we were using the static variables before for stuff like uh, player stats, how we have static here, so we're able to access it from any other script out there. We can do the same thing for functions, um, it's set up a little bit differently of how you access them, it's not a, just a static variable or a static function. Um, so yeah, so I went into player stats and I created a simple function for test and we did debug.log. So this script is going to be showing up in our console view and it's pretty much just for testing purposes just to see if it'll work because I'm not sure if I'm going to be um, calling any functions from different scripts yet for my current game. So. I just threw in a test function just so we can test out the script and <coughs> make sure it's working all properly. So in my click to move script I added a couple of uh, different things. I created a new variable for other and I named it player stats. So whatever your um, script you're trying to call, whatever that name is, you want to plug it in there. And then other, we'll just bring it down here and equal to gameobject.getComponent and we want to get the com component for player stats. So that all gets plugged in there and then depending on which function you want to call you want to say other so it links up to these right here dot test and then yeah so whatever function you want to call you want to put it in there so yeah since we're calling tests we will just be plugging it into there. So that's all you need. You could throw this code into the update function. So if you're maybe adding to a score and you wanted to add over here instead, or I mean in here, you can uh, constantly having it update with something like if you had a, a variable in here that you wanted to add you would uh, put the variable in here and do like plus plus or whatever you want to do. But yeah, for now, we'll just be doing other dot tests. We'll, that will just load at start. So if we press play, um, we can go into window, console. You call the function from another script. So it's working perfectly fine. Um, Hopefully you guys can find some use for this if you want to be calling functions from different scripts. I know for some things it helps out a lot if you're maybe trying to call an attack and you want the enemy to take damage or something like that. You can call a script for just damage. So it's a um, pretty helpful bit of code so hopefully this helped you guys out.